Congratulations, candidate number five. Now, candidate number six. Or, sorry, candidate number six. Now, candidate number seven. Good evening. You are representing what barangay? Uh, to represent barangay, Alanila. Your question is number seven as well. For what in your life do you feel most grateful? For what in your life do you feel the most grateful? Do you want to translate? Okay. So, saan pa rin ang iyong buhay ka? Pakiramdam mo ay lubos kang nagpapasalamat. Nagpapasalamat po ako na nandito ako ngayon sa mundo at nakatayo ngayon sa stage. Nagpapasalamat po ako sa aking mga magulang Thank you so much. Thanks for your support. Thank you so much for your support. Thank you so much for your support. Thank you so much for your support. you so much for your you your question is question number 18. To a man who has been asleep, asleep for 20 years, what would you say he has missed? For me, the man who has been for 20 years. He means a lot of things. He's the great in this world. And teenage the night, high school life, college, and to be with, him, with her mom. That, that's all. Thank you. Thank you so much, Captain Comfort. Eight. We would just like to request our audience and supporters to please refrain from shouting while our candidates are answering so we could not, you know, um, interfere with the train of thoughts that they have. So they can answer it correctly as they should. Thank you so much. Now moving on to candidate number nine. Candidate number nine is from what barangay? So proud to represent one of the most progressive barangays in Bacolod City. Barangay Tango! Yes, a lot of supporters over here. Your question, we speak? One and the room. Okay. That's question number 17. Which have it easier in life, men or women? I believe that it's about time for us to start looking beyond the gender, beyond sexual orientation, beyond the background of every, everybody else. We create our opportunities by making our own decisions. Tama. And I recognize that in different societies, in different cultures, men and women have it different. But at the, at the end of the day, how do you choose to, to respond to it? How do you choose to fight for your rights? It is your choice that makes your opportunities. Thank you very much for being here. Thank you, candidate number nine. Now, candidate number ten. Good evening, and what's the barangay you're representing tonight? I'm representing Barangay Sika. Barangay Sika, hello there. Now, please put your hands up. All right. Your envelope is question number nine. <laughs> Why did you decide to compete in this pageant? Why did you decide to compete in this pageant? To inspire the next generation to be and rich and the Dream and reach dream, said number 10. Thank you so much. Now, candidate number 11. 
10 is number 11, Billy Ting, and what's the barangay you're representing tonight? I'm proud of the Barangay Tapuling. Barangay Tapuling here, yes, there you go. This is your hello. You have picked question number eight. Why do you deserve to win this title? Okay, believe me. I deserve to win. I deserve to win this pageant because I know myself. I did it my best to this pageant, and and, and I believe. That's all. Thank you. Thank you so much. He did his best. Thank you so much, candidate number seven. Thank you. Thank you so much, candidate number twelve. There's definitely a lot of pressure here, I'm going to tell you that. I was once a candidate too, but of course I can feel the nerve from here, but still a great job. Candidate number 11, now candidate number 12, you are representing what barangay? I'm proud to represent barangay 17! Barangay 17, yes, important as well. And this is your card. You have picked envelope between number 12. <laughs> what do you think is the biggest problem facing young people today? Thank you for this wonderful question. One of the biggest problems the young people facing is the all of us was Take care of your mental health because your mental health is as important as your physical health. Thank you so much, candidate number 12. Now, candidate number 13. Yes. Candidate number 13. You're a barangay. I'm proud to represent Barangay Mandalaga. Barangay Mandalaga. And there you have it. Let's take your question. You have picked question number 13. Do you think that pageantry objectifies men? So do I think this pageantry objectifies men? I think, I do not think that that statement objectifies men. Because we are here to represent our advocacy. Which is we are here that we are because we are deserving to win and we are deserving to stand here in front of you, being one of the potentials, or being one of the best candidates, being chosen to represent at the international level. So for me, we are here to promote and advertise our own kind of advocacy. And, and, and with that, I think that is the most beautiful thing that we are uh, doing as men and as masculinity. That would be all. Thank you. Yes, Ken, for learning and focusing. Great job. Thank you so much, candidate number 13. Now, candidate number 14. And candidate number 14 is representing what barangay tonight? I am proud to represent the beautiful barangay of Barangay Pahanamoy. Barangay Pahanamoy! There, there, there is the rats. Thank you so much. Please make your echo. You have to handle number three. What has been a challenge you've experienced in life and how did you overcome it? The greatest tough challenge that I've experienced in my life is how I establish my self-belief and confidence. Because I am a victim of bullying. And that is one thing that I want to change. I want you to change that you can do everything beyond what you think. I am here because I overcome, I define myself. 
and I want you to define yourself because as you define yourself, the world will believe in you, that you will achieve whatever dreams that you set in for yourself. Thank you. Believe in yourself is the message of candidate number 14. Thank you so much. Now candidate number 15. Good evening. You are representing what barangay? the one of the outstanding barangay in Bacal and City, Barangay One. Before I speak, I want to get a way to my um, Manang Leia. Happy, happy birthday to my um, cousin, Sharona. Happy, happy birthday. Happy, happy birthday there. Thank you so much for being so Beautiful with a heart. <laughs> Thank you. I am confidently. Woo! To make it! That I am confidently proud of who I am today. That will be all. Confidently proud of who we are. Good evening, candidate number 18. You are representing what barangay? Good evening, sir. I am representing Barangay Granada. Barangay Granada is your partner over there. Thank you. 
Now please pick your card. You have picked question number 20. What are your thoughts on LGBT and anti-LGBT legislation? Uh, we have been fighting for the, the rights of LGBTQ or the third gender identities. And I am for it. I have a lot of friends who is a member of LGBTQI, uh, uh, the third uh, genders, and they are good people. So this is my voice tonight, and I hope that let, let us accept them because they are people who need, or also need to be loved, to be cared, and to be respected. That will be all. Thank you. Accept gender preferences. Thank you so much. Candidate number 18, now candidate number 19, join us here. You are representing what barangay? Shout out to all the Luxonian and one of the biggest barangay in the Bacolod City, Barangay Tamu! Barangay Tamu! There you go, you know there? Now, take your card. You have picked question number one. What makes you unique? Thank you for what a wonderful question. I think we are unique with our piece of personal and within our own way. And we are unique to the eyes of to the eyes of God because we are all beautiful and perfect. And I think that, and I believe that every people and everyone is unique with your own. And always believe in yourself that you can do and prove to everyone that whatever it say, be positive and thankful to God. Thank you. Always be positive and thankful to God. Thank you so much, candidate number 19. Now, candidate number 20, join us here. How are you and what's the barangay you're representing tonight? Uh, barangay Mansilingan. <laughs> barangay Mansilingan, where are you? Hello there, good evening, I'll pick your card. And you have picked card number five. If you could go back in time, what advice would you give to your younger, younger self? All right, so number 20 requested to have the question translated in Tagalog. Question number five is, Kung maibabalik mo ang nakaraan, ano ang kayo na ibibigay mo sa iyong nakapabatak sarili? Payo na ibibigay mo sa iyong nakapabatak sarili. Ano yun at bakit? Ang bata ko. Yes, walk Santroga. That's the message that you would like. At gabayan ang mga kabataan. Maraming salamat. And yes, thank you so much, candidate number 20. Now, candidate number 21, please join us here. You are representing one barangay. I am representing barangay Handuman. Handuman! Hello there, good evening to you all. Now, the last hello is for you. And this is question number number six. How do you define success? Thank you for that wonderful question. I think success is not all about the money you have in the bank, or how big your house is, or how many cars you have. I think success is about happiness. Able to find, able to find contentment in simple ways and in life. That would be all. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
you have. Congratulations and thank you so much, Captain Number One, and also one of our staff for Clean Production Gender. Thank you so much for joining me on stage. Once again, congratulations, candidates. This is the moment that we have found out how well you will be able to compete or continue in this competition.